A deadly pest and disease are threatening the health of California's citrus trees. Citrus greening disease was recently detected in Valley Center and agricultural officials are racing now to keep it from spreading. CBS 8's Rocio de la Fe joins us in studio tonight with what this disease is and what we're learning so far, Rocio. Yeah, well, the bacterial disease has been found in a total of five orange trees on a residential property. It was found during regular inspections and the discovery has led the California Department of Food and Agriculture to issue a new citrus quarantine in Valley Center. Nasty disease. The deadly citrus tree disease known as Wong Long Bing or citrus greening has been detected in Valley Center for the first time. The disease is spread by an insect that feeds on citrus trees, leaves and stems. The uh insect sucks on the leaves and puts this bacteria in there and clogs the vascular tissue. So even if the plant is getting properly watered, uh, the water doesn't get out to the tips and the tips die back and then it affects the fruit. Ted Safford specializes in tree care and maintenance and says the disease has devastated the citrus industry in Florida and could have similar impacts here if not caught early. It's uh, potentially devastating here, and that's why the authorities are all over it, trying to quarantine it and, and keep it under control. It, it's been so bad in Florida that the price of orange juice is outrageous. Agricultural officials say the disease is a major threat to San Diego County's $138 million annual citrus crop. Safford says the disease can have deadly consequences. There's no cure for this uh, citrus greening disease uh, and the tree will decline and die in just a few years. The best way to protect trees is to stop the disease from spreading and recognizing the symptoms. Deformed fruit, the fo uh, sometimes the fruit will be half green and, ha and, half, and half orange. So you will notice uh, yellow veins on, on the leaves. Um, and you'll sometimes you'll see blotchy yellow uh, growth. Now, it's important to note that the disease is not harmful to people or animals. County officials are notifying local citrus growers, plant nurseries and other related businesses. And Rocio, we know that this is happening in Florida. Now we're hearing it's at least in the Valley Center area. Is Are we seeing this in other parts of Southern California as well? Well, unfortunately, the disease is not new to San Diego County. It was actually found back in 2021 in Oceanside and then again in Rancho Bernardo earlier this year. There are existing quarantines in those areas to get the disease under control and prevent it from spreading. Hopefully some relief will come soon. Mm. Rocio, thank you.